When you look at that church on that day yeah. and you saw that awesome choir and you heard Bishop Curry and then you also heard other bishops from the Anglican Church and you looked at everybody and you really thought to yourself like, wow, everybody does come together. It was like, very and inclusive. It was gorgeous and beautiful it and happy. like heaven's going to look. I you think know what? you mm -hmm. are right. Yeah. I think you're right. How about you? Did you have a favorite moment? Um, I loved... Well, I think because Harry looked so vulnerable. He did. Didn't he? And I she was the one that was in total control. She seemed like she was like, oh, Well, yes. she had just played a bride. Yeah. On, <laughs> on, 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 on some suits. <laughs> so when he pulled up her veil, I yeah. think it was almost like he saw her. And I think he mouthed some beautiful things. But one of the things he mouthed was, I'm so lucky. Like, that's what wow. he was feeling. And I thought, look at that. Look at him. He bit his lip. I'm so, so lucky. What? Look, no, that's beautiful. I bit his <laughs> lip. is like, it's like, I love you. I can't you even. You bit a few lips. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Oh. oh they just, you can tell they're just so crazy about each other. It's beautiful. And their kiss was beautiful, too. What I it comes say, down to, Hood, is that they're, 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 they're royalty is, uh, bleeds the same red blood as everybody else does. At the end of the day, we're just people. You're We're right. just human beings. And I beings. think what I loved about this is when I came home, you sort of heard that everybody was talking about it. So in the middle of all of whatever the worries are in your life or in the world, you had like a moment where you just could yeah. look at love and go, yeah. oh, wow. Yeah. There, there it is. It was there beautiful. It is. That's what it looks beautiful. like in 2018, right? I loved it. And that, oh, my God, you know who keeps getting overlooked even though he should? The cellist who was... Oh, I didn't Amazing. hear that. We were on the way to the airport then. <gasps> that guy was so good. And um, we learned that he comes from, like, a whole family of sort of prodigy musicians. Uh -huh. And, in fact, I looked for him on Twitter. Oh. And do you know what? Here, let's listen just a little. Um, I was looking for him on Twitter, and I saw that on the day after the wedding, he tweeted video of his sister who was playing the piano. And I, I think they're a family of seven, and they all are six or seven, and they all are music prodigies. Wow. Is that amazing? They should take their show on the road and make the Von Trapps look like amateurs. <laughs> By the okay. way, the celebs coming in, that was fun. That was like past the popcorn. Our Oprah's here. Oprah was there. Was there <laughs> I could Like believe. three hours to go. She was early, man. Yeah. I mean, Oprah walked in. She was one of the first. The Clooney's walked in. Yes. Did you see the Guardian's headline was like, Amal Clooney, you know, arrives in a beautiful yellow dress with, you know, uh, and they described her work, and they go, along with her husband. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and someone but... kept tweeting, the Guardian has it right. Yeah, she, she makes a statement Victoria, always. Yeah, she, there's uh, oh, Abigail she... and Priyanka Chopra. Yeah, they look beautiful. And James Corden showed up. That was fun. It was kind of fun because we didn't know who was coming. Interesting mix. Yeah, Elton, Elton John. Elton's husband, uh, David. Yep, and there's Gina Torres from Suits. The whole cast of Suits was there. Bonnie Hammer was there. Saw Bonnie. She looked beautiful. Saw our friend Deborah Turness, yes, who stood be yes. our boss around here. Yes. It was lovely to Bonnie see her. Bonnie went, went to the wedding. I know. Yeah. Bonnie was invited. <laughs> mm. I know. That Bonnie I, gets around. I kept to There asking, was a show like, called The Royals on, 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 on the E Channel or something, so maybe there's something to do well, with that. A lot of people got some viral attention, as did you, Miss Gifford. I'm, I'm sorry. Again. You put on a hat. You, just put, you put one bird no, on you your put head. A bird on. By the way, you were swapping <laughs> hats with the people out on the street. Yeah. Okay? And that fascinator got a lot of attention. I gave everybody the bird. That's what they wanted. Yes, and, and I they, gave it to them. And that's how they liked it. And I, people are tweeting me going, and, and Instagram said, how can I buy, where can I get mine? I said, I don't know. I took it off somebody's head right behind. Well, people were making comparisons if you looked at the viral moment. No, I to didn't. another uh, another person who dressed oh, that way. Bjork. Bjork. <laughs> yeah, she too was dressed well, similarly. Uh, Megan and I had been sitting there for three hours, and I think you guys came to us twice. <laughs> so I mean, anything that went by, I was going to stick on my head. It was we were bored to death waiting for you guys to talk to Speaking us. Speaking of sticking on your head, we found this. <laughs> we thought that would have been a good one too, but we figured you picked the right one. <laughs> There's another bird moment when I was here with Regis. Remember that was that? it. Oh, that looks like that it was, was that happened down in the. Uh, no, no, I think that was, was it. it. I think that was the was Regis it? Yeah. with the red bird. Regis was there. Yeah. Yes, okay, that was the Regis one. Okay, Regis was. I've had a lot of birds land on my head. All right. By the way, some days you're the pigeon, and some days you're the statue. <laughs> if you know what I mean.
<laughs> All right, Hot Off the Presses, three official photographs from the royal wedding, wedding photographer. photographer. Look like, at this. <gasps> wow. Look, look at the line of that. That is just exquisite. And by the way, just look how all everything just works in that photo. And look at Megan's mom, Doria. We're t we haven't really given enough attention to Doria, but um, by the way, that's a gorgeous picture. Just beautiful. Just Doria beautiful. Raglan walked in there. Um, she was the only member of Megan's family, and she sat there proud, proudly in that church. And I couldn't help but think, wondering, I mean, she was obviously overflowing with pride. But I, I was also thinking, it must be so amazing Surreal. for her. Yeah, because she's in a place where, you know, everything's different, and she is, yeah. like, making her way in, and I'm just gonna but read this. at least this. we share the same language. Well, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, no. Listen to how she described her mom. I thought this was beautiful. This is how Meghan Markle described her mom in one of her blogs. She wrote, dreadlocks, nose ring, yoga instructor, social worker, free spirit, lover of potato chips and lemon tarts, and if a DJ cues Al Green soul classic, call me, just forget it. She'll <laughs> swivel her hips into the sweetest little dance you've ever seen, swaying her head and snapping her fingers to the beat like she's been dancing since the womb and you will smile, and you won't be able to help it, and you will look at her, and you will feel joy. I'm talking about my mom. Wow. Isn't that beautiful? That almost sounds as if you wrote it about yours. I think yes. that's why you respond to yeah. it that way. Yeah, yeah. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there, and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.